Hi there! Today we're going to talk about a recent brand and website redesign that I did for Jolie Joe Photography. Jolie is a young ambitious photographer from Texas who focuses on seniors and wedding photography. We're going to look at the before and after transformation that took this discouraged photographer from oh she looks affordable to dream clients saying we just kept coming back to your website. If we haven't met yet, I'm Carrie. I'm a brand designer, strategist, and show it website designer, helping creative entrepreneurs attract their ideal clients, establish credibility, and grow with confidence. We achieve this through intentional connection-centered design that aligns with your business goals and strategic positioning. Now back to Jolie. So her challenge. Like many creative entrepreneurs, she struggled with confidence but not necessarily confidence in her photography abilities. She struggled with insecurity about her brand and her website. So in her own words, she says, I feel like my website just doesn't truly show my work and what I'm capable of. It feels all over the place. I think a lot of business owners can relate to that. The biggest struggles that we saw in our initial consultation were a lack of clarity about her brand styling and her positioning, a website that wasn't reflecting the value of her work, no clearly defined journey for prospective clients, and as a result of the other three, she lacked confidence and didn't feel like she was in a position to grow her business to the next level. So while she came to me because her website was kind of the thorn in her side, it actually wasn't the real problem. The real problem that she was struggling with was lack of clarity and inconsistent branding. So Jolie opted for a show it website template and matching semi-custom brand kit from my template shop. I'll link that down below. And as with any rebrand, we wanted to start with strategy because laying a strategic foundation is just essential before you start any sort of design work. So the goals on the brand strategy and design side of things to design a cohesive, sophisticated look and feel that reflected the positive, outgoing personality of the brand. In particular, we wanted to infuse more energy into, into her brand with a warmer color palette and bolder typography. On the right, you can see her mood board and some of the keywords and just um, the visual direction that we wanted to lean into. And on the website side of things, obviously we wanted to showcase her photography style and showcase the value that she brings. We wanted to tell more of her brand story. Her old website was kind of bare bones when it came to, to copy and very limited copy. And we wanted to elaborate on that to build more connection and also tell the story through her styling. So like I said, the, a warmer color palette and bolder type that's just going to communicate more of the brand personality. We also wanted to design strong individual sales pages for her two main niches, which, were, or which are weddings and seniors. And then add in some subtle playful, playful elements like a GIF on her about page. Now the process. So once we had a solid um, strategic visual direction in mind and we knew the way that we wanted to go, it was time to start designing her brand elements. So her logo, uh, refining the color palette, the typography, a monogram logo. You can see all that on the right uh, with her brand board. And on the left, you see me being a stickler about the details. I felt like uh, some elements in the chosen font were kind of clunky, so I wanted to go in there and clean that up and just really have it um, come across as refined and sophisticated, but still a bit modern. That was really reflective of her brand. Let's just take a minute to look deeper into the transformation on her website and particularly her about page. So on the left, you see the before, and on the right, you see the after. Now notice the impact of the colors. On the left, her colors are cool, dull neutrals, and they just, they don't bring, um, they're a bit lifeless. They don't bring that energy that her brand needs. Whereas on the right, the warmer tones are really infusing that energy. They, they make her brand feel more approachable 
and engaging, and it really communicates that passion that she has for photography. The type as well um, communicates uh, the energy. So if you see on the left, the titles are, they are, they're almost lost, right? I mean, you can hardly see them standing out. Whereas on the right, we went for a bold type that uh, is really going to grab the viewer's attention. Now, as you know, the about page is uh, probably one of the most visited pages on any given website because people want to know the person behind the brand, right? They want to know about who you are and look and see if um, you're going to be the right fit for them, if there's some connection to be found there. So while the about page is about you, it's not really about you. It's about how you serve your clients. So going back to that point on infusing more connection centered copy into her website, this is especially true on the about page. So if you look on the left, on the before, you see that um, there's just a strong focus on Jolie, Jolie's favorites and Jolie's life. And while that's important, and we definitely infused some of that into the, um, the new website, we wanted to um, switch gears and, and frame it in a sense of how Jolie's story has impacted her why and how she better serves her clients for it. And finally, the result. So within a week, Jolie launched her new brand and website to the world. Now she has a website that truly aligns with what Jolie Joe Photography stands for, an authentic, elevated experience with a touch of fun. Some of the wins that she shared with me over the last three months, she says she's now booking higher quality leads. So rather than being the go-to because she looks like she's the most affordable, People are coming to her because they truly value her work and they say, we just kept coming back to you and we want to work with you. She's also noticing a stronger Google presence. She says she's never had more organic traffic in the, than she has had in the last three months. So that's super. And finally, she has a website and a brand that she loves. So here at The Creative Accent, we specialize in custom brand and web design for the creative entrepreneur. If you'd like to see the full case study on Jolie Joe, head over to thecreativeaccent.com. You'll find this on the blog. I'm also on Instagram at The Creative Accent if you want to connect there. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to receive more design tips and brand breakdowns like this one. Have a great day.